What's up guys, welcome back to Kiva's World and today is my 18th birthday and today I'm gonna be getting my first tattoo. My parents do know so it's nothing like that. They don't necessarily like it but I'm not a minor anymore. I can make my own decisions. I'm about to go with my friends Chelsea and Brianna and they said that they might get one too and I hope that they do because I don't want to be the only person getting tattooed today. I'm gonna get the outline of a star on my hand right here and it doesn't really have a specific meaning. It's just something that I've wanted for a long time and I finally get to get it today. I did look up some meanings for stars and it says that it represents good and positive things. And another thing that I really like is that it's light in the darkness. I feel like that's something we all need to see in our lives right now. And that's actually something that I have trouble seeing in bad situations. So that just makes me want it even more. And one more thing, I know some of y'all are probably judging me because you don't like tattoos, but I promise you, I've really thought this through and I know that I want it so I promise I won't be that person that gets their boyfriend's name tattooed on them and I'm sorry if you have that but I like tattoos it's my body no hating <laughs> I'm taping the GoPro to the dashboard so it doesn't slide like last time I'm getting nervous guys it's just it's the pain. I'm not even scared of the needles, but like I just don't know what it's gonna feel like at all. We're going. <laughs> We're doing this. We're not checking out. I really hope they let me film in there too. That's another thing. Cause like I need something to show y'all. They don't even have to be in it. I just need to show y'all this. I'll try my best to not be awkward because I hate vlogging in public. We are going as a walk-in so we don't have an appointment. But it's first come first serve so we're going like right when they open but i really hope they let us get it because if they don't then my birthday is spoiled <sighs> so i'm coming up on the place oh my god i literally I, okay i see the place i see the place i'm here right now and i'm a little awkward because there's somebody in the car next to me so i'm just gonna look at my phone but i'm waiting on chelsea and brianna and we're gonna go get tattooed okay i'm here with them now Stay here. Wait, I'm not even in it. Oh, yeah, I'm not in it. Sorry. Um, we're about to go in. So we walked in and they said that they were kind of booked today, but to call back in like 30 minutes to see if something's available. So I guess we're gonna do that. But the guy was nice, so that's something. I just I hope we get it today because I really I really want it and I'm nervous now. <laughs> I'm mean, nervous. Wearing all this hard You did what? Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> Cute. <laughs> we just got our tattoos. Yeah, here's mine. Kind of can see it. <laughs> the it bandages aren't see-through, yeah. but here's mine. Aww. It didn't hurt that bad. It was just on the bone. That was the worst part. I'm back in the car now, guys. I have a tattoo. It really still stings, though. It, it wasn't horrible. It wasn't as bad as I thought it was gonna be. I told them it was my birthday. So I think that's why they let me get it because like they were still hesitant when we came back. Everybody was actually really nice though. I don't know why I thought they were going to be like buttholes. It was just a feeling. I thought it was going to be more of like a cut type of thing. But it was really just 
like stinky the whole time. Somebody said that it was kind of like heat because of like the friction, the needles go in and out. But like it was just just a lot of stinking. I just got home. I took off the bandage. Here it is. I'll show you guys more inside, but I'm about to go show my parents. So now that I'm back inside, I can show you guys the tattoo better. And I showed my parents. I guess they reacted how parents react when their kid gets a tattoo. They're not crazy about it, but they know that I like it. So, but here it is. It's a little red. And of course it's gonna change over time. I think tattoos like shrink because like the skin's swollen. I'm not even gonna pretend like I know what I'm talking about, but I love it. Can't stop looking at my hair. I've already been taking Instagram pictures with the poses. <laughs> I do need to get some stuff to clean it. They gave me this card and they didn't really like give me any <laughs> instructions to be honest. He just said like take the bandage off in an hour and he gave me this card so that's all I know. Okay I got the stuff and y'all are gonna have to excuse this camera angle. I know it's crooked. I'm gonna try to fix it later. I just got some of this lotion. It's fragrance free and then I have some ointment right here and then it just says wash with antibacterial soap so that's just like regular hand soap that you use. I need to wash it first. I'm scared. Cause it's like a wound, it's literally like a cut just with ink in it so it doesn't look like one. Okay. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. Oh God. I do know that hand tattoos like don't last as long as other tattoos just cause you wash your hands so much. So that's something I'm a little worried about. It's so worth it though. Like I love like small hand tattoos. Like I'm in love with finger tattoos, all that. I have told more people in my family and it's kind of split. Some people think it's cute. Some people just don't like tattoos. Like not that many people in my family have tattoos. So it's just kind of like a rebellious thing to do, I guess. I like it though. So that's what matters. If any of you by chance have tattoos, and you know how to take care of them, just please leave that in the comments down below. I could really use all the tips. I feel like I used to think that you just go and get the tattoo and then there you go, you have a tattoo, but you have to do like a lot. It does burn a little bit, I'm not even gonna lie. But there we go. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and end this video off here, but hopefully you guys enjoyed it. If you did, make sure you give it a huge thumbs up and share it with your friends. Sorry I'm like kind of bad at vlogging. I'm trying to get better with like, filming out in public it's just a little awkward but hopefully you guys saw enough of the process this is definitely an experience i will never forget it's something so out of my comfort zone because i've never been in a tattoo shop or anything like that but i've always wanted to get one on my 18th birthday and it happened and i love it look at it Justin's still here by the way. But follow me on my socials. I posted a picture on there. They're on the screen right now and they're also in the description down below. And check out the Kiva's World website. Scan this QR code to get to it and it's also in the description. And finally, the most important part, make sure you subscribe and hit the bell so you don't miss my videos because it's my birthday and if you didn't, then you'd be a cruel person. So do it. But anyways, I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.